Hi you guys, so welcome to my channel. Today is moving day slash unpacking day and just getting organized whatever I could on this day. So come along with me guys. This has tons of motivation and tons of updates as well. If you are new, I would love if you hit the red subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up if you guys enjoy it for some motivation for cleaning, organizing, and unpacking. And let's get into this video. I am just so excited to share this with y'all. Hey you guys, and welcome back. So today they're just unloading everything and assembling some furniture. They are not going to be unpacking everything they're going to come back and pick up boxes but the day is finally here we get our items back after a full month of not having our items so to say the least we're really excited and then because of covid we are going to be unpacking a lot of our items and they'll just come back and pick up the boxes like i said so welcome if you're new and hopefully you enjoyed this little video i will see what i can get done i am definitely wearing a mask and so is my husband and then the workers are like half and half uh, like you know not really but some are um so yeah we got our work cut out for us but they're going to be like taking the papers off of the bigger items and yeah i'll show you guys the process All right, so things are coming along. That lamp is really crooked. It was not crooked before. But we have some items in here now. And then that was a food town we had in the office. And then here's our desk. But I wanted to tell you guys, if you wanted to see an empty house tour, I will have that video up already. So if you want to check it out, get a better idea. But I will be doing recording as much as i can and like i said i will be doing room makeover slash refreshes just changing it up and you know trying to make it nice so i will be like filming all of that and lots of organizing happening but yeah things are coming along slowly but surely So these are the boxes that we're going to unbox in here and they messed up a ton of stuff they did not assemble this correctly there's like parts left over and then my husband's unboxing some electronic items and then it took them forever to put this stuff together um this is a futon but we're gonna go through these boxes ourselves because of covid and whatnot and then this is the dining room. All right, and this is what our guest bedroom looks like. There's TVs and craft items slash I don't even know. <laughs> and this is Abby's room. Just some random things. She's does not even go in here at all. But we just had to place it in here for now. Got a big old cut from when they were opening this bed up. Raiden, are you helping at all? Yeah. <laughs> Alright you guys, so they are done. Um, we are Home Depot because they messed up the boys bunk beds and my husband needed some bolts and some screws that were missing but bolts because they stripped them so he had to use his Dremel to create that notch to remove it <laughs> and then he had to fix all the desk like nothing was the way it should be 
but he was able to of course fix it because he's like a fixer upper very handy type of guy um and then the babies are so tired that's how tired they are go get some food after home depot and then yeah i've i've done a lot of phone calls today because Changing a PC primary care provider, which is our primary doctor, has been a pain in the butt. It's just like craziness. And then I just got a phone call for our Wi-Fi. And then we're on hold for Best Buy. <laughs> um, Best Buy. So we're having a washer delivered. Well, we were on Saturday. Today is Monday and they can't get it to us until Wednesday now because they forgot their driver's license so they couldn't get on base. So we were running out of underwear and clothes in general. So we had to go to the store yesterday to get underwear for us because we were all out. <laughs> Um, but we, wor we weren't supposed to be out because we were supposed to have uh, the washer, you know? But anyways, and I'm on hold. If you hear music, it's because it's Best Buy. But my goal tonight, I really want to get the kitchen done because I have to go grocery shopping because we need groceries. We don't have any. So I hope I can get that done tonight. Like try to unpack the kitchen it is currently five o'clock and the movers were supposed to arrive between eight and nine eight and nine and they were late it was like 9 20 maybe 9 30 somewhere around there so and they left around three i want to say it is i don't even know what time i don't know <laughs> but we finally got this together um those bins will not be staying in there we have to remove them Oh, but my husband had to fix a lot of these bolts because a lot of them were stripped. Pretty much all of them except two. So yeah, the boys' room is so much bigger than their last bedroom. So I know they're super excited. And then we have those clothes hung up so far. And I'm in the middle of sweeping and mopping these two bedrooms. That way they're kind of like clean and ready to go. So when we step out of here, out of these two rooms, it will be like the dirty zone, I guess. <laughs> but I'm going to do this part up until there. And then the rest will be like the dirty zone. Um, and here's our bedroom. This bed never looks so good to lay on. Oh my goodness. I'm a lot of work to do, but we'll get there. If you got past my story time and that crazy of a day, <laughs> you are the bomb.com. Thank you guys. Here I will finally begin the cleaning and unpacking and organizing, but it was just such a hectic day. I just felt like I wanted to share this with you guys because not everything will go the way we want it to, you know, and that goes for many circumstances, but it's what we make of it. And recently when I did our house tour, our empty house tour, if you haven't seen it yet, to make sure to check it out. But someone said, cause I kept saying it's a basic home, which guys i am so beyond grateful for this house but you know it's got a lot of you know basic amenities but man am i so grateful for them but she put that it is what you make of it in your home and i was like you're absolutely freaking right like it is what we make of it and um i just thought that was really it just hits home and it's what we put into our house, you know? So if you guys have anything smaller or not as like fancy, I guess, it's what you make of it. And just coming from our little Hawaii home, I'm just really grateful for this home and the chance we've been given for this home. Am I really that big? 
Holy moly. <laughs> I like to take tons of pictures, but to see it in a video, my belly, I was just not expecting that. Alright, this is done for now, y'all. Oh man. The floor looks really orangey in the video. You told me more than once to show you my intention. My brain gets blocked at times, but now somehow I'll give you my attention. You've got to know that I I ain't a person who understands all the clockwork of our romance. You make me feel so alive. All right, and my big helper, Jakey, he was actually bored and he was looking for something to do. And I was like, well, do you want to unpack boxes? And he was all for it. So I am so thankful for him that he wanted to. And they took a nap earlier in the car, so they were okay. Um, they were tired, but he was ready to tackle these boxes. So he helped me and really did help so much if you're gonna be moving on solo wait a second because they're playing the best song i'll be there if you reach out to me And my game plan was just to get the items out of the boxes because I just wanted the boxes out of here. So I was setting everything on the counters and then later in the video, you will actually see my husband like, why aren't you putting stuff away? And I was like, cause I just wanted the boxes out of here, but I was running out of counter space. So I ended up putting away some items just to clear off the counters. And so on the following day, I was able to tackle the last few boxes that were left, but you'll see that here shortly. I don't wanna feel this way, but it's not that easy. You're complicating things for me. No, it's not that easy. Maybe just a little time can heal me, but it doesn't feel the way. What are you doing to me? But you break my heart.
while I was unpacking all of these boxes with Jake, my husband was, of course, unpacking some electronic boxes in the living room. So that's what he was doing. He was completely nonstop all day today, but he was doing what he could in the living room and the other areas in the home while I tackled the kitchen for some reason. There is just so much in the kitchen. I don't know. It's it's mind blowing to me, but him and I were able to tackle lots of things on this day. Bending over has definitely been more of a pain lately. So I was having the boys help me with not having to like bend over too much. And they helped me put in some pots and pans in the bottom section because I was already moving stuff around. And as you guys know, when you're moving and just moving in, you are just trying to figure out what works best. So make sure to stay tuned for more videos because all of the organization and even some decluttering will be happening because even though this house is a bigger, I feel like some of the things we just don't need. So, and I just really want to make this home just simplistic and, you know, still make it to what we like, but I just don't want to have too much clutter in everywhere. Let me know if you guys are like this, if you like more stuff on your, around your house, or if you just like it more simplistic. I just feel like when it's more simple, it's just more inviting and warm. I don't know. There's just something about it. So I'm really trying my hardest to not over clutter my stuff. So hopefully y'all stay tuned for this awesome journey that I'm hopefully gonna achieve. I 
am done for today. This is the progress. So we have one of these is actually a living room one. So it's three and then four. Um, oh my word, guys. I'm so tired. Um, so, yeah. You can see the progress. All the cups. I don't think I've ever had my mugs all together because I've had them so spread out because I've never had room for them. Make sure to stay tuned for my next video for tons more motivation. And I will leave a couple videos for you here to watch. Make sure to check them out. Thank you guys so much for being here. And don't forget to hit the red subscribe button. And give this video a thumbs up. Because if you guys made it this far, you definitely like what you're seeing. So make sure to stay tuned for more videos. And I will see y'all on the next one. Bye.